The Century Club of San Diego is the local 501c3 that is sanctioned by the PGA Tour to run the Farmers Insurance Open. And that event is executed at Torrey Pines. Torrey Pines is a very unique property. It is the only uh, PGA Tour golf tournament to be played on a public municipality golf course. From a media standpoint, we have roughly a media center that holds up to 120 media personnel. And we are on not only just national and local, but on international broadcast as well. The players, the, the fans, our sponsors are our number one priority. We need to make sure that they're, they're safe. And if there is anything we can do to add to the overall things that we're pursuing to protect those individuals, we're absolutely gonna do that. If everyone goes through metal detectors when they come in, they're, they're wanded, their bags are searched, and for the first time ever, we've had airspace awareness, which was really a great peace of mind. The whole process with SkySafe was extremely simple. Once we signed the contract, within a week, we had it to where we're doing site visits at Torrey Pines, coming out, scouting both golf courses and understanding what needed to be done to actually put in the, the infrastructure or the, the net, if you will, over the Torrey Pines property. We didn't have to make an investment in any hardware and any equipment. It was a one-stop shop. So as a part of that, we worked with both NBC Golf Channel and CBS to actually register their, their drones this year. So then once those drones were actually launched and being utilized at Torrey for the footage for the coverage there, is that they were approved. It was great to have the ability to, to whitelist drones so we could know who was supposed to be there versus who wasn't supposed to be there. With SkySafe, one of the great things was is once a drone was launched, you were actually able to see where that um, launch origination took place. And then from there, we communicated with local law enforcement who were dispatched to go to that location to actually see who that operator of the drone was. And throughout the week, we had 12 detections and we had nine engagements by law enforcement out of those 12. Everyone in Unified Command really enjoyed SkySafe being there. If you have the ability to actually see what's happening from what's being launched from a drone standpoint, if someone is potentially gonna be dropping something onto their property, also too, you have to protect the broadcasting rights. If someone's going up there and actually taking unauthorized footage, that's something also too that we're protecting against as well. If you have the ability to do something to further protect your, your fans, your sponsors, the players in this case, you know, why wouldn't you do it? I know that moving forward, SkySafe is gonna be part of the Farmers Insurance Open.